Hello, welcome to this video. My name is David Owasi, founder at Outreach Genius, and I'm going to be sharing with you how our tool LinkedIn Genius works to help you create personalized responses with AI in combination with LinkedIn automation campaigns. So let's get started. Now, this tool is going to help you generate more leads on LinkedIn, especially if you're a B2B uh, if you're B2B business. So let's get started. Now, this is what the platform looks like once you log in and you're all set up. Uh, that being said, though, the first place you want to start is through Sales Navigator. So Sales Navigator allows us to load up uh, sales navigator searches, so list of prospects that we want to reach out to. So here's how it would work. So you uh, on sales navigator here, we can select, you know, we can do a, just a simple search here, uh, look for founders of companies, uh, perhaps who live in, let's say, who live in uh, in New York, right? So if you're looking for founders who live in New York, and maybe we're looking for founders who are in the, so we can pick a space here. So let's say in the marketing space, right? So in the marketing services space, um, and once we click that, uh, now there are a lot more things we can do here. If you're interested in learning more, I have created a different video, which I can we can provide access to you on how to do searches on Sales Navigator. But as you can see here, we have a list of founders who are in uh, who live in New York, and we can use it as a basis of our search. Now, let's go back to our platform here. There are a couple more things I want to show you. The first thing is, uh, once we have done our search on Sales Navigator, we want to load all of those people in here. And to do that, we click on the search button here. And once we click on the search button, here, as you can see, I do have a few other searches already. I can start a new search here. And once I start a new search, I will name it here. And for example, we'll just call this one test and then we'll go sales navigator search. Now, there are a number of ways we can load up uh, people. So we can load up by email address. We can load up by just URLs of the LinkedIn profiles. But in this case here, we can load up using the sales navigator URL. So this URL right here. So we can copy that and we bring it here and we uh, load it in and we add the search task. And I won't need to do that because it's a, a test. But once we do it, here's what you can expect you can expect to see all of the profiles of all of those people loaded in here so that's the first thing now the second thing we want to do is we want to set up the uh ai uh, we want to train jira which is the ai to really understand your product your services and what you're all about because that's what we're going to use as a prompt to then create uh, all of the uh, the auto, the uh, AI generated responses that are personalized to the response of, of the person that you are reaching out to. So let's get started with that. So for us to do that, we're going to settings here. And by the way, this is something that Outreach Genius that we will help you set up once you are uh, onboard. We have our onboarding team that will do all of this stuff for you so that way you can get started with running your campaigns quickly. So the first thing we set in the AI setting, as you can see here, is uh, you know the name, uh, your industry, and then also the first thing we're we, next thing we're doing is we're describing your product and services. So what are your product and services? You know, for example, our origin is what we do, how we do it, what sets us apart, our pricing structure, uh, kickstarting your journey, trials and, and testimonies, navigating challenges, and then also we we'll set up. Uh, your personal description. So what's it about you as a owner, as a business owner or whatever it is you, you are? Uh, we want to understand your background, your personal traits, your location, uh, your family information. If you want to share that, you can basically make all of this information as you wish. And you know we will again help you with all of this so that way uh, the AI can understand precisely what you're all about. Now, there are a few more settings we do here. We, we map what we call intents. So we divide intents into friendly intents, engaged, interested, uh, meeting requested, not interested, and not a fit. And basically, the idea is that once a response comes in from the automation campaigns, which I will show you in a minute, we want to map all of those in all of those messages into a set type of intent. So we want to say, is this a friendly message? Well, this is the instruction for Jira, the AI, to create a response and on and on for engaged, interested, meeting requested, and so on and so forth. And we do have some additional settings. And that one here is that we want to optimize for either pushing straight for the goal, which is to book a call or to try to engage first. Now, I personally always try to engage first before I you know, go for booking a call. But of course, if you don't want to do that, then that's up to you as well. And this is a summary of all of the information that I've provided about me and my offer. And as you can see, it's a very, very detailed and comprehensive summary. Now, there are a few more additional settings for example, you can set up the, 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 the volume of connection request messages, open emails, invite by emails and group messages, and those are settings you can do. Now, the next thing I want to show you is when we create campaigns, 
uh, when we when we use our tool, LinkedIn Genius, you want to create automation campaigns to begin the conversations. And when you begin the conversations with automation, the idea is that AI, Jira, will now step in to help you create personalized responses. And we also even have a feature that can do that uh, on auto uh, auto responder. So basically the AI, after a while of trained and learning your offer, we can have it run by itself. So that way it can, your, your whole response is being done automatically with AI. But we always are very careful to set that up because we want to make sure that the AI is trained properly and you're happy with all of uh, the responses before we kind of let it go. So here's an example of a campaign here. Uh, and I do have a few here. So uh, 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 we have automation steps here. And as you can see here, we do have connection request message. And again, this is something that we will help you set up once you get onboarded. So that way you focus mostly on responding properly and booking meetings. Uh, our team will help you set all of this up. But as you can see here, we have connection message. We have, you know, uh, after four hours of connecting, uh, here's a response. And we always like to optimize for asking questions so people can engage and begin conversation. So here's one of our favorite questions I love asking. What's the one thing you wish people knew, uh, more people knew about your business? I'm always on the hunt for stellar businesses to champion within my network. And people always love engaging with that. And I also like giving value. So for example, another thing I, I love, I'm doing in my sequences is, hey, I'd love to add value to you. I put together my best strategies for generating clients with AI powered code outreach. Grab it here, no opt-in is required. And here's a link uh, for that as well. And um, again, I find that people respond really well when you give them something. And then if they're not responding again, then that's where I start to then talk about, hey, are you currently using code outreach for your campaigns? And I start to really talk about my offer and then offer them something that they can uh, take and say yes or no to. So here's the automation sequences uh, that you know really begins the conversations. And once the conversation has begun, that's where AI steps in. And if we go into the inbox here, you'll see I do have a number of conversations here. And, um, and let me just find an example of a messaging that uh, we've used AI to generate. So here, to generate the response or to show you how that works. So here's an example of a message interaction with Derek Jones here. As you can see here, we had the automation of begin in the conversation and this person says schedule with me so uh they all want they wanted to book a meeting right away and as you can see here uh, the ai mapped the intent that this was meeting requested right so that was done now the next thing is if i want to send a response and i want to use ai to create a response here's how it would work so you you have to pick the message you want to use ai to generate a response to and you will see there's a little small you know ai uh, little uh, icon here so you want to click on that little icon now one of the things we do when we onboard you is we will set up a few prompts and you can always add and manage more prompts but you can always add more of these prompts but as you can see here we do have a few prompts here so let's see for example uh, I want to use, um, I want to uh, uh, sell them on my offer, right? So which is what most people would want to use the AI prompts for to do. So I can go select, uh, sell them on the offer. And then I use identity generate AI response. And what the AI is doing is, is looking at the response and the conversation we're already having. And it's also looking at all the things that I've trained Jira on. And it's combining both of those to then create uh, a message that aligns with the intent here that I want, which is sell them on my offer. So let's read it. Hey, Derek, I just checked out your LinkedIn profile and I'm truly impressed. Your diverse skill set and extensive experience speaks volumes about your expertise in your field. I believe uh, leadgenius.ai, which uh, was our offer back then, uh, would greatly benefit you because it offers a streamlined solution for lead generation, saving you valuable time and efforts. I highly recommend exploring their platform and leveraging its powerful tool for uh, efficient prospecting. Keep up the great work. Now, if I like this, then what I can do is I can go use AI response, right? And then it gives gives me all of that information here, and then I can send it if I like. If I don't like it, of course, as you can see there, I can regenerate the prompt for it to give me new prompts. And if I don't like the messaging that the prompt is generating, all I just need to do is I need to go into AI prompt right here. And as you can see here, are all the prompts, right? And if I don't like it, I can just ask it to generate new prompts for me. And uh, I can, well, I can, I can, gen I can just write new prompt if I want to, or I can use AI to create new prompts. There's so many ways you can, you, know, you can do this. It's very, very flexible, but this is how everything is connected end to end. So from, you know, starting the, the campaigns, 
using automation to get it launched, and then using our uh, Jira tool here, you know, the AI that we've trained to really uh, create those personalized responses. And you know, that's what you can expect with uh, LinkedIn Genius. Now, there's a lot more things that LinkedIn Genius can do. There's a lot of ways we can help you generate more appointments with this. So uh, this is just a quick, brief overview of how, uh, how uh, LinkedIn Genius works uh, as part of our set of tools here at Outreach Genius. So super excited for you to try it out. And of course, like I said, if you uh, if you get uh, if you uh, if you're interested, our team will help you get everything set up so that way you can focus on just really speaking to your ideal, your ideal clients and of course booking appointments for your business. All right, that's it. We'll see you in the next video.